At the meeting on Tuesday, Bob made an attempt to speak and address the Board of Disgrace for their ridiculous decision to hire a police officer who was arrested for a DUI. They have minimized it, they've negated it, they've dismissed it as some big deal, it was just a mistake. And what is so unbelievably appalling and revolting and obscene is that Harpy, she would go, she'll go to whatever ends are necessary to further her own agenda. She took advantage of a woman who was just grieving from the death of her husband and had her come in there and stop Bob from speaking and from reading out what was on the police report. Well, it didn't work because it backfired and Harpy and her board of disgrace and all those council reps who never said a single word to stop this show, this, this massive catastrophe from unfolding in front of our eyes. I'm now going to read it out for all of you to read, to, to listen to, because Bob was stopped from reading this to you. This is how serious and insane it was that they then went and hired this man after this description. This is from the, obs the observation of the driver. I walked up to the driver door of the vehicle where I met the defendant and asked him to step out of the vehicle. The defendant complied and stepped out of the vehicle. When he stepped out of the vehicle, I immediately observed an odor of an unknown alcoholic beverage that intensified through the defendant's slow and slurred speech. I also noticed the defendant's eyes were red and glassy and he swayed in a left to right back and forth manner while he spoke. I asked the defendant if he had any medical conditions which he stated he did not. While I was asking him if he had any medical conditions, I noticed he bumped into the side of his vehicle and also leaned on it several times. After I spoke with him, I asked the defendant to follow me to my patrol vehicle where I observed him stagger from side to side as he walked. This is how he described his speech, slow, slurred and mush mouthed. What is so objectionable? disgusting, disgraceful, is that Harpy had Kavita rushing over to Bob to shout out proudly, I've had a DUI, you've had a DUI, everybody's had a DUI. Were we living in the twilight zone? Are these people, what are they on? It's absolutely inconceivable, incomprehensible that these people are running a $40 million budget. No wonder it's in the mess that it is. It is impossible for them to have done this correctly or done it well.